Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2, Pax Romana. Alright, in the uh, last episode, we uh, took the uh, Duchy of Toulouse. Now we're waiting for our uh, armies to get back within our land so that we can uh, release the levies. Um, I have decided to... <coughs> mm, sorry about that. Uh, invite a couple people... Um, to my court, um, because uh, this guy has a claim on Ferrara. Unfortunately, he's also celibate, so I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with that. Um, he has no kids, so he's not going to have any. Uh, I could land him and then go take the stuff. Uh, it's a possibility. Um, his heirs would uh, um, certainly be his brothers, though. That's part of the problem. Uh, on the other hand, uh, we do have... Uh, he does have two brothers here, um, so I might go uh, try and take them. Is that primogeniture? That is primogeniture. Hmm. It's a shame that wasn't Gavelkind. Oh, well. Um, so, we will see what we can uh, do about uh, getting something going for uh, um, Ferrara that way. Um, there really, I think I, I, I did invite a couple people who had Latium, but there weren't really many people, so I don't know that that's going to do much for us. Um, and of course, there's no one with claims on Genoa, because it's a merchant republic, so I'm going to ha I'm definitely going to have to, uh, fabricate a claim there. Uh, on the other hand, uh, Italy is at a, is going on a holy war for Flanders against France, and... What that has done is uh, dramatically uh, reduced the amount of uh, troops that he has available. He is losing his uh, event spawn troops. Uh, so this guy, he has a uh, weak claim on the Duchy of Latium, uh, which will be inherited. This guy is not in my um, court, though. Uh, same thing with this person. So we'll see how that this all goes. Their wives might die. Maybe I'll marry them or something like that. Alright, there we go. Let's go ahead and uh, expand our levies. I've got my uh, retinue there, which let's see if we can make some more. Alright. I was able to make a little bit more. Um... Let's just have you move down to Rome. Should have uh, plenty of... Uh, um, yeah, we're going to have plenty of uh, uh, supply limit throughout there. Alright, we've got a child lacks a guardian. Let's go ahead and educate her. Mm, go with her. That's fine. Uh, let's see. So I've got... Uh, Strymon that I can press a claim for. I could actually do it. Let's uh, let's see how this. Uh... Oh, how did he get to a hundred percent? Oh wow, he has a lot of troops. All right. Well, uh, maybe let's not do that just yet. Uh, incidentally, haha, <laughs> de jure empire. Ah, uh, it's fun. That's because uh, Bulgaria. <laughs> All right. Um, I got some uh, ransoms. Really, at this point, I just need to work on getting the. Uh, remaining parts of Italy. It'll be a little annoying. Let's see, we've got about uh, 50 years for that still, so that's not too bad. Um, a son was born. Alexandros is fine. Another son was born, Tiberios. That is fine. 
Uh, the population in Madia has been converted to the Orthodox faith. Excellent. Let's, uh, let's see how... Where exactly is our... You're in Gizeh. Alright, you're down there. That is not converted. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's converted. None of those have... I believe pretty much all of our... The rest of our borders have converted. It looks like. Well, not these areas. They still need to. Okay. That's fine, though. Um, it kind of looks like, uh... Juan Alfonso is, uh, not doing so well. They got levy reinforcements. That's good. Uh, daughter was born, Sophia. Alright. And it looks like I am getting some... How am I getting... How was I getting, uh, attrition there? Oh, out of supply limit. That's what it was. I mean, uh... Wasn't supplied for a long enough period of time. Oh, well. They're okay now. Okay, um, I have fabricated a claim on the Duchy of Latium. That'll cost me 600 gold and 300 prestige. That's why I have all that gold. Let's go ahead and use it. All right. Um, vassal, vassal levy penalties have not gone away yet. Down to minus four. Let's see, how are you doing? Wow, you're celibate. That is weird. Alright, anyway, um... Let's see, we've got... We facing 5,000 troops? Oh yeah, this is fine. Declare war, claim Latium. Oh look! We're about to uh, just completely destroy this uh, Genoese uh, retinue. Ah, uh, fun times. Let's head up there. Let's let these guys get in first. Aw, oh, Helene Dragon, you died! Oh, you died a leper. Udo Carling, we need to... Need to marry you to someone. Any dragons? We do not have dragons. Oh, oh, you're 42. Dang it! All right, let's uh, let's sort by age. I'll go with you. There we go. All right, so you need to be re-educated. Fine. All right. How long until you get there? Uh, July fourth. I didn't even realize I was uh, sieging a treat a uh, trade post. Oh, uh, one thing that I noticed. Um, Amalfi here. Uh, the Pope is his liege. It's... Don't even... I don't have an option to declare war. It's not even grayed out. I don't think I can declare war on this guy. At all. Um... That is gonna be very annoying. Uh, I might have to just wait until this pops out at some point. Alright, for... Whoops. Let's go ahead and raise my personal levies. Get them all up there. Uh, lost to say uh, trade post of Treviso. That's fine. I don't think the trade posts uh, give any war score. All right, Euphemios Dragon. Let's go ahead and educate you. How about Marshall with Isidoros? There we go. <coughs> Five ships. 
Get on board. Come over there. Catfile is afraid of the dark. Try to address the causes the causes of the fear. Uh, 30% chance of diligent. Percent chance of diligent. Trusting is better. He has gained diligent. Excellent. Alright, let's go ahead and pull you into uh, that county. And dock you up there so we can get rid of you. There we go. All right, I think we'll just uh, sit here and siege down. Not too worried about him bringing in anyone else. Good, uh, betrothed can marry. Uh, might not be able to do this while at war. No, it looks like we can. Okay. Mastermind Theologian again. Oh well. <laughs> he hired some, uh, he conscripted some merchant ships. Way to go. I don't know why they always do that. Alright, two children lack a guardian. Ustinos. Let's go ahead and not with you, not with you. Um, Mew. And Theodotos. It might become Frankish, that would be annoying. Um, so let's not. Count of Neapolis, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, you're Greek, but you got a lot of bad trades. Let's not go with you. Guess we'll go with Bastardos again. Alrighty. I'll just continue to siege this down. I suppose I should move over here. There you go. Still losing uh, trade posts. Not a big deal. My half brother Zenobios asked for a fife of his own to govern. Church career! Steward Constus II has uh, some interesting ideas on how to improve the economy. 32 gold? Sure, why not? The children lack a guardian. Ah, son! My son! I will educate you myself. Jihad for Mauritania. The great Shia Caliph Mubarak has decided to call a jihad against the Kafirs in the Sultanate of Mauritania. He urges all righteous Shia Muslims to take up arms against the depraved Sultan Ixfensun II of Idrisid Sultanate for the glory of Islam. Allah is merciful. That's no concern of ours. Ah, uh, Mahdi, huh? How are you currently doing against, uh... <coughs> 5% in favor of Shamshir. He's now known as the Unready. Ooh. Toledo took the rest of, uh, or, uh, um, yeah, he's, he's a Sunni Castilian. Wow. He took the rest of, uh, uh, Castile, which probably means that, uh, no, he's uh, actually pulling back on that. Does he have allies? Uh, Lotharingia and Asturias. Yeah, I guess he does have allies. Okay. Oh, well. All right. 
Duke Reynard, huh? You are Frankish. You're two, though, so... Oh, you're not even my, uh... My vassal. Never mind. Alright, we can assault this. Let's go ahead and do that. And that. And that. There we go. And then we will take this one. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, crap. It did slip out of my grasp. Hmm. Well. I think we know where we'll be going next. I need to take that back. Um, who are you at war with now? You joined in with Poland, okay. Where is the rebelling Poland? Did you Mazovia? New. Catholic. You you have no actual lands. How? How? Because Lesser Poland took it. <laughs> That's just weird. That is weird. It's really weird how that works. Anyway. Um, we could probably assault that, but, uh... A son was born to, uh, Sofia... Krinites. And this child is born a lunatic. Wow. That's pretty impressive there. That is rather impressive. Uh, daughter was born. Uh, Parthena. That's fine. Let's go ahead and assault that. Uh, son was born. Germanos. Ah, oh, it seems my dalliance with Pavlina has resulted in a child. Alexius thinks he is his. Whoops. Euphrasia has died. Dang it, you were only 20. Arg. And it looks like you've left to go home. Well, you weren't all that great anyway. Alright, that means that you need to be re-educated. do we have? Anyone who is like gregarious or something? I'm go with you. It's not quite as good of a learning trait, but let's see how that goes. Alright. Call the arms from Aragon. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna decline that. What exactly are you doing? Ah, Holy War for Aragon. What part of Aragon? Oh, the Kingdom of Aragon. That's... that would be it. Okay. Wait. No. Oh, that's right. That's Barcelona. That's Aragon. Wait. 
Oh yeah, and you're the king of Aragon. That's right. Never mind. Do, 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 do. Pay more attention. Pay more attention. Uh, let's see. Where would be good to go next? Hmm. <laughs> um. I suppose I could go up and uh, siege down Genoa. That would be. Uh, since I, I do need that eventually anyway. Let's go ahead and do that. Andreas Dragon became a skilled tactician. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and find you a wife. Um, let's see if we can find someone perhaps with a claim here. Let's, uh... I need Ferrara. There. Ah! Hey! Invite to court. Thank you. Um. You're probably married, aren't you? Yeah, you were married. Okay, so. Can't do much with you. Um. Alright. And I can't do anything. I can't marry into Genoa, so. That, that won't help me much. Hmm. Eh, yeah, she's strong. Sure. Alright, decides to accept the betrothal. Excellent. And this guy is joining my court. I think I will murder her when we have a... Oh, 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 oh. Where are you going? One to friends. That is plains, that is hills. There we go. Hello! Let's go ahead and crush you. Trade post defeat, that's fine. Alrighty. And just for the heck of it, let's go crush that army. I've gotten a uh, claim on uh, Genoa. Let's go ahead and use it. Population of Narbonne has been converted. Excellent. Alright, crush them. Your commanding presence on the battlefield was felt during the recent victory by friends and foes alike. You bolstered the spirits of the, the men when it was needed most, and you personally led the final charge that broke the back of the enemy army. Songs will be sung of this day. Indeed they will. Alright, we're at 100%. Offer peace. Thank you. I have usurped Orvieto. Latium. Let's go ahead and head down to, uh, well, actually, let's get there first so that we can uh, disband. Alright, so now I technically have, uh, too many, um, yeah, I cannot, uh, I can ransom a prisoner? Huh. Yeah, I cannot declare war on this guy. That's that's going to be very annoying. Um, and obviously, since this guy has a liege, I cannot declare war on him. Nope. So I kind of just have to wait until he's independent in some manner. Um, I think Pex is going to be next. But now, let's see. Intrigue. Oh, yeah. And I've lost control of all... Uh, Capua. Um, but, 
The Duchy of Latium is completely controlled now. Alright, excellent. Okay, so, uh, this county is mine. <coughs> and I was actually thinking, um, Rome has three baronies, so it might actually be better than just the two of Constantinople. So I don't know. I am going to have to think about this a lot. Um, if I went for another, uh, um, like perhaps uh, Tuscany. Tuscany is a pretty good duchy too. I could go for that. Keep that for myself. Um, that might not be so bad as my uh, personal domain. I don't know. Uh, Constantinople is pretty good, though. Let's see. People are now going to be annoyed that I have uh, three duchies, though. Oh, that, that's right. These are allies. I want to court. Let's see. Yeah, too many held duchies. The domain too big. I don't know. I don't know exactly what I want to do yet. This guy, I'd kind of like to do something about since he's, uh... Metropolitan Gautier of Orbitello. Let's see if... Whoops. Uh, find characters. Alright, we do have some choices, but, uh, let's see about... All right, we do have some celibate people. Um, so let's go ahead and start by giving uh, Orvieto. Let's just first make sure, yeah, we've got no family. So we'll give Orvieto to this guy, so it'll come back to me eventually. And grant land title. Duchy of Latium. So it'll eventually come back to me. And there's still another uh, celibate person that I can give uh, a title out to, so it's not so bad. So truce is expiring with uh, Umiades. That's fine, I have no desire to go to war with them anytime soon. Go ahead and disband. Uh, auto balance. Make sure that you're balanced well. Okay, so next we are going to have to go against Pex. Your claim on Napoli. Let's just go do that right now. I don't need much to do that. Uh, I might say screw it. Truce break against this guy so that I can get Genoa. Uh, I am 47, so I'm not. I'm probably not going to die too soon. But rather than waiting the uh, many years to for the uh, um, truce to end, being a truce breaker might be better for now. I don't know. I'll need to think about it. Um, he is defending against uh, Dietmar the Bold in a war over Savoy. All right. Who's Dietmar? Burgundy. Burgundy is not very big. Alright, let's, uh, oh, it's the year 1000. Let's let, uh, well, now nah, we'll go to 1001. January 1st, 1001. Or January 2nd, as it probably will be. Yep, alright. In the next episode, we will, uh, get Napoli back. So, I'll see you then, everyone.